as is the tradition in SSB Short Shot Academy, we give a comprehensive feedback to the candidate. You behave as you have got the whole, after Modi, you are the most responsible man in this country. All the problems of the country you are facing. Are you the one? Yes, sir. And you are going to give us a good news. Yes, sir. That's and I don't know when are you going to give a good news. I'm not asking the good news of your marriage or uh, birthday or some kind of ceremony. You can now get a free SSB course under the guidance of Major General Bhakuni at SSB Short Short Academy if you attend any of our written courses for NDA, CDS or FCAT. Attend 4-5 to five lectures daily and prepare with study material, mentor support, weekly feedback, mock tests and guidance by officers in our lush green 28-acre military campus. Call us now on 725-930-7111 for queries and registrations. Now let's get back to the video. Good morning. Today, 132 course has completed its 12 days intense and comprehensive SSB course. As is the tradition in SSB Short Shot Academy, we give a comprehensive feedback to the candidate. Look at that. Today he has an opportunity to meet the all assessors in the conference. So in my table with me, we have our seasoned and most experienced interviewing officer, Brigadier Kazwalia. Then we have our psychologist who is so popular among candidates. In fact, there are lots of candidates who are queuing up for her assessment. She is a very busy psychologist and one of the best in the country. And on my right, is one of the best GTO who is most popular again among the students. He is Colonel Sajeev Kumar, who is highly dedicated and always wanting to improve the candidate's performance. And of course, next to him, we have our senior administrative officer and assistant GTO, Sunil Saab, who was in SSB Bangalore for four years. He also has a vast experience. So with this, what we are going to today do today, we are going to get every student one by one. And after that, not only in the conference, we are going to discuss about him. And after that, we are going to give him a comprehensive feedback, which is so important for a candidate. Today, the candidate will know what does the psychologist feels about him? What does the interviewing officer feels about him? What is the GTO's opinion about him? And of course, I am going to summarize the whole thing by giving him marks as it is given in the SSB. Out of 225, I will generally tell the candidate where exactly he stands. And let me tell you, this process enlightens the candidate. He knows what he needs to improve. He knows it is a kind of mirror which is shown to the candidate. He understand himself. He would have done a complete self-introspection. He knows exactly for SSB what all OLQs, officer-like qualities he needs to improve. It's a wonderful day for the candidate. And let me tell you in SSB Short Short Academy, the candidates are eagerly waiting for this great opportunity. So with this brief background, we are getting the candidates one by one. Yes, one then. Good morning, sir. HS. How are you? I'm fine, sir. Are you tense? No, sir. Are you confident? Yes, sir. Okay. You are looking a bit serious. What is the reason? Uh, just uh, in the class, you are not like this. Yes, sir. So please sit down. Thank you, sir. So, one, tell me, the first thing I would like to ask you, what two things you discovered about yourself in the last 12 days? Uh, yes, sir. I was uh, able to introspect well and uh, come out with my strengths, weaknesses and uh, where I lacked, I was able to improve on it. And also, uh, I was able to practically apply the knowledge 
that I earned during the years through my experience. Uh, I could practice all the uh, obstacles and etc. So, okay. Now today you are very lucky, though you have been interviewed. Psychologist feedback also separately was given to you. The GTO also interacted with you separately. Today it's a wonderful day where in the conference your case has been discussed. Yes, sir. And today every one of us is going to give their opinion about you. Let me see what the GTO feels about you. You will get a straight feedback from GTO as well. Here we go. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Mandan, you are a, a capable candidate who can speak very well. You can express very clearly. Nothing wrong in communication skills. However, you need to be a little more lively yes. and sometimes you are a little tentative in your behavior. You have the confidence, you have the capability, but you are not opening up too much. However, you have participated wholeheartedly in all the discussions, so I don't think there will be any problem in that. What you could do now is to be a little more lively and look a little more serious, uh, less serious. Yes, sir. That should be adequate. Yes, sir. And if you do that, then you can be any, any time you can pass. Yes, sir. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Okay, let me see what the interviewing officer feels about you. Vandan, good morning. Good morning. And uh, as I had mentioned, it, which has also been uh, mentioned by the GTO, a uh, bit of more liveliness in your interaction when uh, you are in a group that will help you out in clearing the entire thing. Your self-awareness as well as the awareness of the environment around is adequate and with a little bit of more liveliness you should be able to make it. Yes sir. Thank you sir. As I already told you during feedback you are good but don't do everything yourself. Yes, Include sir. others. Okay. Yes sir. So, one the Yes, sir. So, you are waiting for a good news. Do you think? Tell me, how has been your performance in this SSP? Tell me. Uh, sir, yeah, as I already told, I have uh, discovered what I lacked. And uh, yes, it has been a good experience overall. And uh, it has given me a basis on what I can build further. So, I think I've done well and there is always room for improvement and I'm confident I'll do well. In okay, tell me, out of all the candidates who were there in your group, say yeah. there were 12 in the group, in that, where do you stand? Tell me honestly, where do you put yourself? I'd say in the top three, sir. You are in the top three? Yes, sir. And if I ask you, in the top three, which one you were? I'd like to be the first. You like to be, but you were actually the first? Uh, yes, sir, I could say. Okay, then who was the second and third? Uh, chest number one was quite good in his performance. Uh, chest number eight. Yeah. Uh, chest number two as well. Okay, okay, one then. Let me tell you, you are a good candidate. See this, you are a possible candidate. Yes. Sir. You are just a borderliner. You have virtually we have with a bit of one odd marks grace we have passed you. Okay. Can you believe it? You just got 90 marks okay. out of 225. You are a passable guy. This yes. time you are going to pass provided you display your confidence little more. Yes, you display your liveliness little more. Yes, sir. And you have little better body language here. Your face doesn't speak. Your body doesn't speak. Look at your facial expression. Yes, sir. I'll See this, your body language is lacking, your liveliness is lacking, your confidence is lacking. Yes, sir. Are you getting me? Yes, sir. So you got to little bit give it extra. Otherwise, let me tell you, you are an intelligent guy. Yes. Sir. You are reasonably confident guy, reasonably. Okay? Your power of expression is also reasonably good. Yes, sir. Are you getting me? Yes, sir. So stop being so serious in life. Yes, you sir. behave as you have got the whole, after Modi, you are the most responsible man in this country. All the problems of the country you are facing. Are you the one? Yes, sir. I'll, <laughs> I'll take the press conference. You understood now what yes. I am trying to say? Are you? So, improve your happiness a little bit more. Is yes, that understood? Sir. Yes, sir. Any suggestion for us to improve? No, sir. No suggestion. Tell me one thing which you like the best in the academy. Sir, uh, the overall experience I can say. 
uh, all the guidance, uh, all the uh, interviewing officer, GTO, psychologist, uh, you, all of you were very friendly with us. You guided us like we are your own kids. So I like that. Good. God bless you and you are going to give us a good news. Yes, sir. Definitely. And I don't know when are you going to give a good news. I'm not asking the good news of your marriage or uh, birthday or some kind of ceremony. Yes, sir. You know what good news I'm looking for? Uh, getting recommended in SSB. Okay. You know, there is a guy last time in the conference, I asked him, when are you going to give us the good news? He said, the day I get engaged. <laughs> so, I don't want that kind of good news. Yes, Have you understood? Yes, sir. God bless you. All the best. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Good morning, sir. Good morning, ma'am. Good morning. You are Bhairavi. Yes, sir. Okay. What is the meaning of Bhairavi? Sir, Bhairavi means fearless. Fearless. Yes. Are you really fearless? Yes, sir. But I can see you are a little scared and little worried. Why? No, sir. I'm not worried. Okay. You are scared? No, sir. I'm happy. So, where, where we Yes, sir. Tell me, what two improvements you have made in your personality in the last 12 days? Sir, uh, I think that coming here, I have developed the spirit of being a team player. And the set, second factor is that I have improved my English. You have improved your? English. Okay. English language. Okay, okay. That are, these are the two things you have improved. Okay, tell me, out of the three techniques here, that is psychology, that is GTO, and the interview technique, which one you feel you enjoyed the most? Which one you found yourself, you know, where you learned a lot and why? Sir, uh, I think that I have enjoyed GTO a lot because more activities were included in it. And uh, in learning part, in both interview and uh, psychology, I feel that I have learned there. Okay. Tell me now a simple question. What two things you would like to improve in your personality still? Still. Sir, uh, I would like to work on my psychology and uh, on my general awareness. Okay. General awareness. Okay. Let me see now what the GTO feels about you. Because let me see what is his feedback about you. Over to the GTO, please. Thank you, sir. Bhairavi, your communication skills are certainly in place and you've been able to express very clearly. You've been assertive also in all the activities. Your liveliness has improved over the days. It was a little less in the first two, three days, but it has actually come up to the required, almost come up to the required standard. And if you continue to be focused and improve further, you should be able to be recommended whenever you go for SSP. Okay. Let me see now what marks have you got. Tell me, what do you feel about your performance in this SSP? Do you think you have made it? Or do you think you are a borderliner? Tell me. Sir, uh, I think that I'll, uh, my, uh, Im I would improve in my interviewing part and uh, in my psychology part too. And uh, in GTO, I think that I was fine. Okay. Okay, Bhairavi, uh, you have done reasonably okay. I will not say you are a sure short case as of now. Bhairavi, you have to still work harder. You get out of 225, 81 marks. You still have 9 marks to cover. Why? Where we, it is simply because you are a bit too serious. A bit you got to improve your social adaptability. Okay, the team spirit as well as your liveliness factor. Is that understood? Yes, sir. You are taking interest and I also saw you in the classes. You tend to overanalyze things and overthink the issues. Why do you overanalyze and overthink? Tell me. Sir, uh, maybe because I want to improve. Uh, that's why I tend to overthink about the factors that I can improve in myself. Okay, that's good. If, the, if, if it is just to improve yourself, then it's fine. 
but it should not lower your confidence. Yes. It looks that your self-esteem may be slightly low, which you got to improve. Your confidence will further go up. Are you getting me? Yes, sir. Okay. So, where we keep working hard, your goal is not very far off. Okay? Thank you, God bless you and all the best. Thank you, sir. Sir. Good morning. So you are the girl from Kerala? Yes, sir. Oh my God. Kerala people are how? How are they? They are good, they are bad or they are very good? Very good, sir. <laughs> Give me two reasons why Kerala people are good. Tell so, me. Sir, they are humble mm -hmm. and uh, they give uh, accommodation or they will be socially adaptable so fast for everyone. Okay. Okay. Tell me two things you learnt here in this academy. So one was my communication skill regarding the psych test. How should I observe the pictures? Those things, sir. Then the other one was my DTO, sir. Okay. So these are the two things you learn. Yes, sir. Okay. Tell me, in case you are asked that one thing which you are going to change in this academy, what would you suggest? Sir. One. Nothing, sir. Oh my God, do you think everything is perfect here? Nobody is perfect. So for me, it is satisfied, sir. Okay. Tell me two things which you found very good here. Sir, uh, in psych test, I found everything was, I, I was not that much aware about it. Mm. And I came to know about how to use those th uh, things, uh, sh short and script, crisp. And for GTO, for the command task, how to apply the you know, logics. Those things, so. Okay, okay, okay. Swati, though you got the feedback yes, from sir. all the assessors, let me see what the interviewing officers feels about you. Maybe you are uh, quite enthusiastic in your approach. Everything uh, you can think of very well, reason out very well. At the same time, uh, you need a bit of more organizing ability uh, to plan the tasks uh, that are there. Don't go, uh, just jump into it, plan it well, and then do it. Yes, sir. Thank you. Swati, just don't be too conscious of yourself. Yes, ma'am. Anna, everything else is good. Just don't be too conscious. Yes, ma'am. Okay? All the best. Thank you, ma'am. So, let me see what the GTO has to say about you. Yes. Thank you, sir. Swati, um, you are a very lively person and the liveliness is almost infectious. It is good and you have been maintaining that throughout. Your communication skills is also adequate. You have participated reasonably well in the uh, discussions. And one good thing about you is that you have been physically very fit. You have done all the obstacles with relative ease, yes. including the, the tiger leap. Yes. So that's a good effort and um, uh, with more focus, towards uh, general knowledge aspects and other things, you should be able to make great. Yes, okay, Swati, tell me, suppose you get through which regiment oblique core you are going to go and why? Sir, I wouldn't know anything hmm? about it. Sir, I wouldn't know anything about it, sir. Yes, I wouldn't decide. What was the question? Sir, the regiment which huh. I would go. Yeah? Sir, I would not... You have not decided yet? Yes, sir. Okay, you do not know as of now which yes, branch you are going to opt for. You don't know? Sir, I, since I am I am in uh, engineering aspects, I am thinking I have to know about it more, sir. Okay, that's what I wanted to make you realize. Yes, Tell me, where is the engineering center, training center? I don't know. Tell me, what is the difference between Madras sappers and Bombay sappers and Bengal engineers. Sir. Have you heard them? No, sir. Where are their regimental center? That's what I want to tell you, Swati, that your passion needs to go up. Yes, sir. Your interest in the armed forces has to go up. Yes, sir. Your passion and interest, because you hardly know about the armed forces as yet. Okay? Yes, sir. Otherwise, you are a very lively girl. Let me tell you, you have a good sense of humor. Okay? You are confident girl. You get around 86 marks. You are 4 marks behind because you got to enhance your knowledge both about the armed forces as well as about the general awareness. Yes, sir. Are you getting it? Yes, sir. And you can 
make it if you work on your personality little more on your knowledge little more is that understood yes, sir. any suggestion for us to improve <laughs> okay god bless you all the best bye bye thank you, bye -bye. Thank you. oh dear candidates let me tell you why ssb short short academy is being such a popular institution for training it's because every facet of personality development leadership team building adventure we touch upon not only in this 12 days a candidate goes through in detail about all aspects of gto psychology as well as interview but in the end we give him a feel of the conference where we give him a complete feedback by the way when our interviewing officer interviews him he also gives a feedback similarly the psychologist and the gto let me see why this is helping the candidate let me ask my interviewing officer what does he feel about it over to him please well it happens that in such a organization where wherein from a to z of the selection process is covered very comprehensively the conference is the culmination of all the process of ssp interview and having a conference also included in the training part of 12 days program two things happen one that the candidate who is there he gets familiar with the environment of the conference and he gets or she gets much more confident about it and number two a comprehensive feedback about where he or she needs to improve where he or she stands in the interview process of the entire ssb interview that is also given to it thank you the conference gives that chance to the candidate to actually have a proper rehearsal of even coming into the hall standing wishing and sitting it is it would also it would help that candidate in the actual conference too and this is the place where a candidate gets a actual cl pin uh, clear cut um, information about the performance and this would give him that chance to improve upon these aspects when they actually go for the ssp so um the psychology classes help candidates to understand their own emotions and thoughts and also to direct them in a good manner okay thank you and all the best see you here sometime we also have a great opportunity for students who are now going to 11th or 12th class next year we have something called the foundation course in which students can join us in 11th class or the 12th class for the foundation course students we have options of the cbse board as well as the state board and along with their school education we also prepare them with evening classes for the nda exam apart from that they also get to live in a total army focused environment in a 28 acre lush green campus with proper military obstacles and you'll also get the support and guidance from senior military officers and experienced educators so if any of the parents are watching this video and if you feel interested in this particular course feel free to reach out to us if you live in bangalore or anywhere close by you can also come over and visit our campus